What are some slang terms a 50-year-old dad can say to his daughter to embarrass her? Just say what up fam then when they get mad yell weldster. I am taking my 14-year-old daughter and her friends to an anim convention. They are all dressing up to cosplay anim characters. I decided to dress up as Indiana Jones, and I guess that is the worst thing in the work and now I am in a hole it seems. When something surprises you, say you are shook. I must be getting old because I came into this thread intending to contribute but instead I'm taking notes. Was pop in Jimbo? Sweetie, you're at a critical point in your life. The choices you make now can determine the outcome of your future. This is why I need you to promise me you'll take school seriously. The sky is the limit if you just try. I only tell you this because I love you and I want you to be woke as f. I try to embarrass my daughter every chance I get as I feel it is truly a dad's job to do such things. She unfortunately doesn't react the way I would like. She finds it cool that I'm on top of pop culture. I even went so far as picking her up in my, what I deem an old people's car, ride with Kendrick Lamar blaring. I was bopping my head, instead of the utter embarrassment her friends started dancing around, and I've become the cool dad. Now I've gotta do this all the time when I get her from school. It's also led to her friends coming over all the time and listening to music at top volume. My daughter trolled me while I was trying to troll her. Be careful it backfires. Say bruh to literally every sentence. My dad never used slang terms. He did things like ask if I applied my rash cream and if my gum disease was bothering me in front of people. To agree with something she says reply facts. My dad used to go into Carl's Jr. and call everyone Carl. Go into Wendy's and call everyone Wendy. Go into a five guys and ask if you can speak to the other four guys. Ugh. My 60 year old mother loves to say things are the puff daddy when she thinks something is awesome or superior. So you should probably point out things that you also find to be the puff daddy. Cringes. She knows exactly what she's doing. Wondering what she's up to today? Spice things up by saying AI what's Gucci fam? We're heading to the park wanna join? It's gonna be lit. Chuck in an aff to lit and this is for sure one of the best ones. Hilarious. I'm practicing these for my son. He's having a coronary because I have a bit magy. Wait until he hears me talk. I use the you ain't woke fam. I'm too lit. On my 15 years old daughter. I'm 46. Her exact response. Walking by without looking at me. I don't even think you understand what you are saying. While you're reading the paper just quietly and slowly say Gucci gang Gucci gang Gucci gang Gucci gang in whatever tune you feel like. I'd recommend channeling Sinatra. Next time her friends are over, tell her you'll leave them alone. But to cash me outside if you need anything. Say it on front of her friends for max damage. Bonus if you dab before you leave. As you leave, just don't walk into anything. Edit. Backwards with a fidget spinner in your outstretched hand. Maybe bumping into the door jam but never breaking the dab. When she gets upset, tell her she's being extra. Side note, it just means you're overreacting, which she will do after about two or three of these terms. Haha. <laughs> Edit. And now my top post is about a term I can't stand. Thanks for the irony Reddit. Was poppin' be- Dedos is a good word. It's a synonym of actually and I'm being serious. Did you dedos? Dedos I did. I must have been about 18 or 19 when I was getting ready to go out with friends when my father asks. Dad, what are you up to? Just going to hang around with your bum mates. Me. WTF. Dad, what? You don't say that anymore? You know. Bum mates. Your mates you bum around with. Uh, no dad. No, we do not say that anymore. Man's not hot. My 13 year old daughters mistakenly showed this video to my husband. He now quotes it constantly and it is driving them crazy. Just call everything dope. Lit or ratchet and start calling her homie. Tell her she's on fleek all the time. Whenever I call something dope, my kids are all like no mom. Just. No.
When she says something innocuous, just say, is that what the kids are calling it these days egg? Dad can I get more syrup for my pancakes? Is that what the kids are calling it these days? Getting syrup for the pancakes? When I was 17 I worked at a pizza place with mostly high schoolers and one 38 year old man. He was nice, but a little creepy at times because he seemed to forget most of his co-workers were girls half his age. I asked my friend who also worked there to tie my shoe because I'd hurt my knee and couldn't bend down very easily. The older man turns around, sees her tying my shoe, and says all surprised oh you actually meant tie my shoe. I assumed that was an innuendo for something. I was mostly confused as to what he thought tie my shoe was an innuendo and why I would be saying it to my friend at work in the middle of the dinner rush. Call her B and then dad. It's even better if you use the slang word incorrectly. On Christmas I walked up to my 15 year old cousin and said dude, are your shoes B or what and the look on his face was truly glorious. Comma try to mix match slang words as much as possible so you make her embarrassed for you. Girl, that handbag is guxy lit. Comma do dabs purposefully purposely wrong. Insist you're doing them right. Sweety, this is how I saw them do it on the YouTubes. I guess I'll just wait for your friends to get here and I'll do it for them. They can be the judge. Do dabs purposefully wrong. Insist you're doing them right. Bonus points. I insist the act is called dapping. Drives my 14 year old nuts. You kids look really YOLO tonight. Make sure and call me if you girls get into any lit. If anyone tries to give you drugs make sure and tell them dab on them haters. Stay ratchet. Woke girls. YOLO. So be careful kids. You ain't woke fam. I'm too lit. Say that verbatim if you want her face to blush with embarrassment. Edit. 80% of the replies are asking what it means. In layman's terms it means you are not social aware conscious as I, I am too cool. 46 year old mom here. I just texted it to my 15 year old son and got really mom as a response. Fleek. I will give no context. No definition. For maximum embarrassment potential. All you need to know is that it's an adjective. Edit. Hey I, I. Thanks for all the cake day posts. Y'all are too kind. Just told my daughter she's being extra after she walked into my bedroom telling me she couldn't go to school today. Daughter. No I'm not. Me. This is a Gucci morning. Daughter. Oh my god. Silence follows her stomping out of my room. I walked past my daughter's doorway while she was face deep in her phone. I was playing Snoop Dogg's doggy style album on my phone and stopped to twerk. She nearly turned her face inside out with scorn. It was wonderful grinning face with wide eyes. I think I will try the twerk next. Thanks. Not sure why I enjoy teasing her so much. I'm literally screaming right now. Also, when my son was in high school, if he was running late and wouldn't be able to catch the bus on time, I would give him a ride to school. The trade-off was that every time I dropped him off, it was as close as possible to the main entrance where all students come to enter school grounds. After he'd left the vehicle and was walking amongst his peers, I'd yell out the window as loud as possible, I love you, pumpkin. Make good choices in my best Carol Brady voice. Edit. Formatting. Anytime she complains about the temperature, say man's not hot, man can never be hot, and then proceed to utter the following statement verbatim. Scr, pap, pap, ka ka ka, skibiki pap pap, and a poo poo padra boom, sky, do do coo coo dun dun, pom, pom, you dun know. Walk up to her when she's with her friends and say, what up G while pointing your fingers around like guns in random directions meaning each finger gun points in a different direction in snapshot like bursts. Keep calling her a cracker if she gets annoyed at you. This works best if she you are Caucasian. X. Her dad. Stop. You cracker Y. Her go home. Please. You cracker no. Randomly scream the ting goes S K R R A T. P A P P A P P A P, Skidaki P A P P A P, and A Pom Pom P M M D M D M. Or spam her friends with deep fried memes. I think the real key here is to say any slang but purposefully in the wrong context. Then pretend you're none the wiser. 
For example, I don't know how many times I've had to remind my mom that WTF does not mean well that's fantastic it makes me cringe every time she does that. Exactly. Slightly wrong is like nails on chalkboard. It's risky. But hey. Yoda. No dad. It's YOLO. You only live once. No sweetie. It's Yoda. You often die agonizingly. Not a slang term, but my dad shared a meme on Facebook with a pink donut and a chocolate with a hand that had two fingers in the pink donut and one in the chocolate donut. The caption was if you don't get this, we shouldn't be friends. My dad and I have a weird relationship. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed today's video drop a like and subscribe. Please check out more of our videos or our playlist. It is perfect for when you want background noise or to put on when you are falling asleep. Once again thank you and have a great day.